Hey guys, it's Brie. Welcome to A Dose of Reality. Today is Friday, so TGIF to you guys. We made it through yet another week. Um, I apologize for my lack of being on YouTube this week. It has been absolutely exhausting. Sorry, I have to move Cadet. Uh, because down here on the floor, uh, what was just delivered to me was four bags of stuff and um, I have no idea what's in here. This is going to be an Elfster swap um, unboxing from my dear friend uh, Brony. Uh, she actually just stopped by my house. So pretty exciting stuff and without further ado, I'm going to jump in. She did give me permission to uh, do this video so I'm super excited. Can't wait to see what is in here. So um, let's see, I'm gonna start with I'm gonna start with this pink bag because pink is kind of my favorite and they're not like numbered or anything so I don't think it matters. Uh, so this is a small pink one and I'm gonna start with that one. So this is heavy. Okay. Oh, it smells good. I smell it already. We have a candle. It's a Better Homes candle in pink sugar berry. That smells wonderful. Okay, glitter and glow scents, and this is in the scent Merlot. I'll give you a sneak peek. Ooh, ooh, it does kind of smell like wine. But look, there's glitter. Cadet has knocked over one of the bags and is now on top of it. So I hope nothing is breakable. Uh, glitter and Glow Coconut Hibiscus. Oh, I love the smell of coconut. And I love that these are all like glittery. I love it. I need more wax, so this is perfect. We have Better Homes and Gardens White Peach Mango, also limited edition. Oh, so nice. So, so nice. Candied Caramel Pecan. Oh, foodie. Foodie scents, foodie scents get me so much. This smells like you're baking something. I can only imagine how this is gonna smell when I melt it. Oh my gosh. I'm getting excited over wax. There's something wrong with me, but that's okay. Scent Sensationals. This is Passion Fruit Coconut. That is delicious. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, you did a wonderful job picking out these scents. By the way, and this is another Better Homes, uh, Sunlit Strawberry Patch. Ooh, that smells really, really good. That's like the perfect, in my opinion, the perfect strawberry. Not like, it doesn't smell like fake strawberry. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? It doesn't smell like the fake strawberry smell. It actually smells like strawberries. Like if you were gonna bake a pie or something like that, it smells like strawberries. I'm so excited. So that was this bag. I'm going on to this blue bag. And I just love how all these bags are like hollow and all of that. So very, very pretty. More papers. I replenished my tissue paper stock. I like that. M&Ms. Can we just talk about the 75 years of M&Ms packaging? Like the throwback. I like it. Nostalgia. What is this? Build a flavor, key lime pie, gourmet gum. Ooh. All right, front, front port lemonade, gourmet gum. Very cool. I'm a candy and gum fanatic. Strawberry shortcake lollipop. Cotton candy lollipop. Oh, there's another one. Oh, hang on, two more. Birthday cake with confetti and root beer float. I remember we used to sell these lollipops when we were in middle school. Uh, we didn't sell them. I forget how it went. Somehow these were sold when we were in middle school. They were like 50 cents or something. And it was like the biggest deal. Like if you didn't have 50 cents, during eighth period to get one of these, like you were just not one of the cool kids. It just, 
it wasn't happening for you. It was not in the cards for you if you could not buy one of these lollipops. And like, Heaven help you if you couldn't get one of the good flavors and you got one of like the crappy flavors. So these bring back so many memories for me. Yes. All right. Oh, Starburst. I love Starburst. What is your favorite flavor of Starburst? Let me know. Um, of course, you know, I'm partial to the pink and the red. Um, I don't know if anyone really likes the yellows. Do you like the yellow Starburst? Do you like the yellow strippers? Um, birthday cake gum. This is cool. I have no idea where you found these, but this is project seven. This is cool. Um, I'm excited to try these. Ooh. And then we have little penguin lanyard and it appears to be a breakaway. So, I think I can get away with using this for work. So I might just have to update my current one because guys, let's just be honest about this. Like, this is too cute. Way too cute. Next is this pretty silver bag. Yellow paper. Everything's so bright. Ooh. Bath and Body Works Vineyard Champagne Kiss. Ooh, body cream. All right, you know what? I'm gonna use it because I can't really smell it in the tube. It's been a while since I've used a Bath and Body Works lotion. Oh, I forgot how they felt. It feels really nice. That smells really nice too. I want to see what's in here. Oh, oh, maybe not. I'll save that for a second. All right, we were getting into this. Uh, this is Carrez Kiwi Gentle Exfoliating Scrub Dry Skin. All right. Let's see. Ooh, if I can use this on my face. Cleanses, refines pores, and deflakes skin without irritation. All right. Yeah, if I can use this on my face, I will be very happy because I've been trying to find something else I can use on my face. This is cool. Very cool. Have some face masks. Yes to coconut. Uh, hydrate and restore face mask. We have a um, hashtag happy hour with red wine and retinol. <laughs> we have hashtag beauty scoop with avocado and collagen. I may not be able to use this one because of the avocado, I might have to check into that, but I love how cute it is. And we have Tony Moly Pureness 100 Propolis Mask Sheet Skin Smoothing. That's pretty cute. It looks like honey, maybe? Honeycomb. That's what's on here. So, of course, I can't read that. <laughs> awesome. I love face masks. All right, what else do we got here? Ooh, I see penguins. With love from South Africa. Now I know um, she had made a trip, so I wonder if she got this while she was on her trip. Chain. Very cute. This is Bee and Flower brand rose soap. Ooh. This is from China. Very cute though. Look at the packaging on that. So cute. I see Colourpop. Let's see. Got a couple things in here, see if I can get them all. All right, see some ColourPop stuff. We have a Super Shock Shadow. Getting better at that word. And this is in eye candy. All right. This is like a lavender color and it is a metallic. 
very cute. It's coming up kind of pinky on the camera, but it's more like a lilac lavender. Let's see if I can swatch it. Ooh. My hands still smell like that lotion, by the way. I'm not mad about it. <laughs> it smells really good. All right. That is, can you see it? Oh, you can see the shine off of it. I think that's going to be a really cool color. There's eye candy. We got, what do we got here? A lippy stick in Poppin'. And this is a matte X. Ooh. Use color on that. There's Poppin. Excited to try this. I only tried one matte X before and it didn't go well, but I'm hoping that it was just that color for me. This is O Snap and it's a matte. Ooh. That is a pretty, pretty, pretty color. That's gonna be one of those like my lip but better kind of colors, I think. But perfect for fall. Oh. There we go. It's like a taupey mauve almost. It's very, it's very different, but I like it. I like it. And last. I heart this, and that is also a matte. Oh, I like the color. This color looks very similar to, um, to, is it Osnat? No. This color looks very similar to Poppin', um, but it's just a matte. It's not the matte X formula. It's slightly brighter. Slightly brighter than Poppin. I like that. I like it a lot. Right. New lippies to try out. All right. We also have an EOS. This is uh, vanilla bean. We have an EOS and vanilla bean. Let's see. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, we have Essie, the Shimmer Brights Collection. There are four little mini kind of size nail polishes in here. A yellow, an orange, a bright pink, and a purple. It's Aim to Misbehave, Sexy Plunge, Scene on the Scene, and DJ On Board. These colors are really, really cute. This is giving me very like 80s and early 90s vibes, the way the packaging is. Um, these are going to be so cute. All right. What else do we have? Ooh. The face shop. It's a hand cream. It's a peach cherry blossom. But look. Look at the packaging. That's so cute. Aw. I don't want to put it on because obviously I already have moisturizer on. Oh my goodness, this smells wonderful. That smells so good. This is gonna have to go in my work bag. No two ways about it. I think it's adorable. It smells good. If it works great, then it's gonna have to be like a repurchase. I'll let you guys know. All right, and there's still more stuff, guys. Tony Moly Mini Cherry Lip Balm. Guys, how cute is this? How cute. Let me take it out of the package. Oh my gosh. And the little cherry stem is like rubber. Like, it's so cute though. And there's your lip balm. That's so cute. Mm. I'm like a child. 
back. All right. This caught my eye, but I wanted to say it till the end. <gasps> Jack Skellington. Uh, Nightmare Before Christmas, and of course, this could be just used for just about anything. I might have to use this for pens or makeup or really anything. I haven't decided yet, but this is so, so cute. So cute. Um, thank you. Thank you so much. And there's still a whole other bag of stuff yet. Oh, wait. I forgot. Hang on. There's still more. And these two things that I pulled out here. So I didn't want to drop them. We have... Ooh. Trying to find... This is cute. It's a polish. It's called Best Day Ever. And it's... Looks like it has smiley faces and blue, pink, and orange hex glitters in it. I don't know that you'll see all of it, but maybe I'll get a swatch up of it for you guys. That is so cute. And then we have, oh, oh, this one's cool too. Kiss and Make Up. And it has little kissy lips in it. It has white and red glitters. The white is hex glitter and then, oh, it looks like there might be pink hex glitter in there also. And then red regular glitter. So that is so cute. To those of you playing along at home, if you've kept track of the number of times I've said cute, bonus points to you guys. Um, Brony, you've outdone yourself, girl. That's for sure. You've outdone yourself. And there is a like gigantic pink bag left and I can't imagine what is even in this one. <laughs> so we've got some yellow paper. Some yellow paper. Some yellow paper. The cat's going nuts. All right. We have, oh dear goodness, we have The Wizard of Oz Dorothy, and it's a rubber duck. And you guys know, and I know Brony knows, that I collect rubber ducks, so this is actually really, really cool, and I'm a Wizard of Oz fanatic. Uh, this will not leave the box. I guarantee you that. It will not leave the box. Uh, and it's probably going to sit. I have a shelf over here like right behind me kind of. It's probably gonna sit over there and uh, be displayed. This is really, really cool. Some people are probably gonna think this is really creepy, but I actually really, really like this. Thank you so, so much. Um, this Toto. I mean, thank you. This is awesome. What else do I see in here? We of course have a card and I will save the card till the very end. We have we have Deadpool. Come on now. Lacey says hi. Cadet's playing with tissue paper. We have Deadpool. This is really cool. Uh, of course. I mean, who doesn't like Deadpool? If you didn't like it, I'm sorry, but I loved it. We have, oh my goodness. We have Mrs. Potts and Chip. This was for, you know, I'm going to show my age a little bit here. Um, Beauty and the Beast was the first movie I ever saw in theaters, so that holds a special place in my heart. And um, my mom and I often look back with fondness on Mrs. Potts and Chip. So this is very, very cute. Very cute. My Funko Pop collection is growing. I'm very excited. I'm gonna have to put like shelves up in my room to display these. All right. Let me see. <laughs> Where did you find these? This is so cool. We have Nightmare Before Christmas socks. There's Sally. We have the Halloween, like the graveyard scene and where he is singing. We have Jack, a big Jack. Uh, we have some spider webs. And then this one, of course, is Jack. That's so cool. And you can see Oogie on the side here. Oh my goodness. Awesome. I love socks. I used to hate it when I was a kid. Now we get socks for like Christmas or something. But like getting socks in like a gift like this is just, you can't go wrong with socks, guys. <laughs> um, let's see. Oh, this is so cute. It's a pen 
and a bookmark in their Wizard of Oz. So this is the Wizard of Oz bookmark is Glenda, and then it's Glenda's wand is the pen. So thank you, this is so cute. Uh, this pen is going to, I would love to use it for work, but I probably won't. I'll probably just keep it at home here. Uh, who knows, maybe I will take it to work and pretend to turn people into frogs. I always dream of doing that. Um, <laughs> Lacey, you got a toy. She perked up. There's a toy for Lacey, it's a little monkey. She's chewing on something. This is so cute. It's so soft. Might not give it to her. Might have to hide it. So cute. Brony has dogs also, so she understands. <laughs> Cadet's content with the tissue paper, so thank you for sending tissue paper for Cadet to play with. <laughs> because he's, he's happy. Oh, and this is a bear, pixel bear, and they both squeak. I won't make them squeak because then she'll bark, but he's also very soft. These are so cute. So, so cute. And then, oh, and this is definitely for me. It's from The Secret Life of Pets. It's a beanie baby, but it's a meaner dog. It looks like Lacey, just with the short hair. He's so cute. Thank you. Thank you so much. So guys, that was my unboxing of our Elfster Exchange. Um, I really am so grateful for everything that I got. Thank you again, Brony. Um, let me quick just undo the card um, so that you guys can see what the card looks like. I won't read it to you guys because it might be private. Oh my goodness. There's penguins. There's penguins. <laughs> oh. Yes, the card. Okay, so she says that this card and the keychain are from the Seabird Sanctuary in South Africa and they help support penguins. So I think that is phenomenal and I'm so happy for that. Um, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I love everything. Um, I love participating in these swaps, guys. That is it for this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe, never miss a dose of reality ever again. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I am Brie51687. Would love to interact with you in those ways. Um, don't forget the Dose of Reality Facebook page for some more fun. Um, I will be back tomorrow. Actually, I'm going to be doing some vlog footage for the MG Walk, and um, I'll show you guys some of that. You can still donate if you would like. The link will be in the description box below. Uh, no pressure to feel like you need to do that, but if you'd like to, it's there. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching and for subscribing, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.